go. Let's go. This is why you didn't commentate. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, did you commentate warmers? for 6,000 stream viewers on the mainstream like Colin and hand I? Hand warmers. <laughs> I, I Dude, love you, Twisty. There's no way that it was just 6,000 for me. It was, uh, it was like because I was commentating. Oh shit, teams. we got a game. Sorry, dog. Oh, they actually started. All right, so we got Puff Falco. Puff what do you Falco. know about this? Uh, what do I know about this? I know that this matchup, I don't think Falco wins. I mean, it's traditionally people say Falco wins, but. Results say otherwise, not only at the top level, but at other levels. Falco yeah. just has a really hard time, like, like, yeah, she, he can pressure Jigglypuff, but he can't close out kills as easily as Jigglypuff yeah. can close kills out on him. Exactly. <laughs> uh, granted, this is Plup. Plup, a very good player right. in it, his own right. The uh, skill difference, I mean, that's something else to be accounted for. So, so as an NC player, the way I relate it is Slip and Slide. Yeah. Uh, slip and Slide is someone that plays many different characters, but he plays them all almost exactly the same. Yes. So I think that's kind of what Plup does, at least with his secondaries, where I would agree. He, he's he's going to win by doing Plup things, not, not traditional, by doing things. traditional Falco things. I will say that it, with his Falco more so than other secondaries, because I believe his Fox has an, a unique style yeah, that's exactly. more so than I, just Plup. I get you. And that's not to say that uh, Plup's Falco is bad or no, will not, not do not traditional Falco things, just that uh, oh, he will choose. Blows him up. In the yeah, corner. he will choose interesting <laughs> options because he's not a Falco man. Right. Which will work to his advantages sometimes, right. and other times it will not. Other times, it's, uh, sometimes it's an overextension. Other times it's just an unexpected option. That right know. now, it's looking pretty good it's looking because pretty good. you know he he Plup is getting this unique advantage where uh, he has lasers now. Right. And you know the characters he usually plays versus Plup do he not do not have lasers. Yeah. Um. He's moving around pretty com comfortably yeah. with uh, Falco, too. It doesn't seem like Aglet's really been able to hold center for stage sure, for, for very sure. long against him. Oh, Aglet's just Ooh. crouching in the corner. Plup, definitely not one to just run in there. He's played Hungrybox enough to know that's probably not the Ooh. best idea. I think he tried to cross him up with that. Potentially. All What's right. The What's the follow up? Just lasers him in the lasers. corner. Lasers. Dab reset rest. Oh. He is definitely playing for PP right now, that's yeah. for sure. He's also with the rest of that. Yeah. Uh, smart by Plup to save his double jump there, yeah. but it won't save him. An interesting stop yes. from Aglet actually. Clutches that one out. Catches Plup going in a little bit more than he should. Bounce smash from the center. Not going to kill. We're going to knock Plup over. You know, this is, this is kind of what Falco traditionally has problems with, is that getting these high percent kills. That's exactly you know, what I talked nothing, about. Man. Nothing's going to link into it. You've got a tech chase into it. Right. Or uh, You can get a stray hit, but how? it's pretty difficult to win neutral with yeah. stray hits against Jigglypuff, you know? Yeah. He generally, I think what West Balls tends to do in these scenarios is a lot of uh, Waveland off wave platforms. Land up yeah, Waveland off platforms, yeah, aerial, is. yeah, or, you know, just Any lots of hitboxes. I like the F tilt, uh, you know, that's Even something that team. it works really good against high percent characters, laser F tilt. It works really well when Pup is just like not ready. For it's it. it's an old school option, but a good oh, one. Oh, what's the punish? That's just a All right, single, a single there. Nine percent. This take is it. uh. This is not like a G6. <laughs> he will not get like an entire combo off of that. Oh, good on him to not shine out a shield there because Aglet uh -huh. actually faded back. Baiting. Oh, important grab. Can't do much off of it, but, yeah, but he, uh, he does. Momentum. Yeah, and he gets he gets positional uh, pressure. Absolutely. Like he gets to just take center stage, shoot more lasers. Amazing down. Like that. That Amazing down. Though. Calls out the jump, but doesn't go aerially in aerial in time to really do anything about it. Oh. Finds double up there, but how do you close that out against Falco? Well, he comes all the way down. That was a beautiful grab. Yeah. And you know, this is a really interesting story with Club because Club lost to Kaon and Winners. Yeah. And so it's kind of like, can can he make Falco work? Yeah. And right now, it's looking pretty good. It's looking doable. It's yeah. Not, I wouldn't say it's looking as strong as. Oh, I mean, nothing, uh, nothing clearly, against yeah. Aglet, but if if Plup were Sheik right now, dog, would we still be talking? That's a great question. Yeah. Well. It's one we won't know the answer to. That's true. Aglet right now actually surrounding some offense, getting Plup a little uncomfortable in the shield. Wow, great jump to right. avoid that X smash. Pup's, uh, oh, all right. That's Pup's shield good. was pretty small. It's probably back to normal by now. Oh, that was a Fades scary down. double jump. Absolutely, I would not have double jumped there. <laughs> I would have double jumped and I would have regretted it. <laughs> Fades onto that platform. All right, scary, tense moment. Oh, if he had gotten that grab, but. Oh, oh, I thought he tech that. 
He teched that. He did tech that. That was incredibly quick. Oh. He needed that. Next big hit might close it out. Aglet oh my chokes God. the edge guard, but yeah. holding shield in the corner. Back oh, throw, not the not throw he wanted. To, oh. That's it. It won't matter though. And uh, club, club not happy. He, he not he, happy. Yeah, he, he kind of like yelled about his controller or yeah. something. All right, well, I owe Sharks five dollars. <laughs> Plup going fox. Plup has had enough of the beak. This is a, this is honestly a treat for me personally. Tyler, Plup is one of my favorite foxes to watch. Uh, I think oh, so no Valgo. He retreat. He no. This is uh, I think the first time. This is the all, first time other than doubles all day. Yeah. I think he's had enough of it. I don't think. Yeah, really I've anything. definitely done this before. Uh, maybe our streamer should update the score though. Well, quick zero to death from Plup. Looking a little bit cleaner than he did before. Guess a double laser on the ground. Oh, all he's taken so far is a straight nair. Oh, oh, reads the wrong roll. Yeah. That's all right. That's a that's a hard read to make. Guess the up throw. No follow-up. Club is moving, man. <laughs> man, this is this is the thing I've done with my fox before too. <laughs> where I'm like, man, my fox is losing. I'm I don't wanna lose. I just wanna win. I'm so gonna go switch on. back to my main. I've done the same with Fox and Sheik. Yeah. I think every player has had that moment. Where you're just like, I wanted to stay this character, like to prove a point, but I also don't want to lose. Right now, I think, speaking of proving a point, um, <laughs> yeah. Plup is definitely making a statement right now. Aglet looks a little bit lost. A little bit. It, it is Plup's counter pick. It's also Plup's Fox. Jesus. Do you, do you think Plup would win Fox if this was on the mainstream? You think he wouldn't do it to upset the fans? I think I think he might. I think he we'll might. Not we'll never we'll never know. We'll never we'll never know. But another unanswered question of life. Well, we will know if he ever gets the mainstream. But this is the fox that took a set off of Hungry Box at Primo. Like this is not any fox. Ooh, as I say that, he yeah, turns around up to call out a back air approach with perfect spacing. And Plup's just been toying with him. Yeah, back. like Plup, he he can finish this off. No he problem. wants he just wants to save his energy. He said, I can win <laughs> this event. Get out of my face. I'll kill you with down tilt. And he does it. A staled down tilt. Nice read. Dude, I, I timed that one, man. You're pretty good. I timed that one. Honestly, I wish I was as good as you. You know? It's like me and Plub finish each other's... Sentences? Sandwiches? <laughs> I did that earlier of ostentatious today, too. It was great. <laughs> All, right. All right. Game three. Yep. This is to make it to top... This is already what? top 16. This is, okay, so, so this, this is, is for 13th. Uh, yeah. Huh? Oh, yeah, that's what I, I thought. This I is lied. for top 16. I'm, yep. This is game three, and that's it. Top 16 oh, right, because Plup was in teams. Right. Yeah. you right, you right. All right, so Plup is already moving. Aglet looking a little bit better right now. Doesn't look as uncomfortable in the air. Yeah. Like, oh. Quickest jab and grab I've ever gross. seen in my career. That was gross. Finding it really hard to cover Plup's dash dances. Holy Christmas on a bun. That was quick. Man, Plup really does not want to lose this, man. Plup looks upset. He's, he's just like, man, fuck this game. <laughs> I fuck did not Puff. come all the way to this shitty, smelly state. To come. Fuck Puff. Fuck Falco. I'm just going to win. He's just going to win. This is a treat for me. Plup's Falco fox moves literally in ways I've yeah. never seen. You've you got a fox, too. You've got a fox that's apparently better than I mine. I'm the fox ditto. There, there are other matches where nah, it's definitely just, not I was better. like depressively bad that day. <laughs> Either way, you're fucking good at this game. So it goes, so it goes. Such is life. All right. All right. Oh, did you bounce, see that yeah, weird? Oh, on the laser. I love that, dude. Star Wars up in here, dude. Oh, my. How did he connect that? He SDI'd it and Plup walked forward just enough to get the grab. Incredible awareness. From him. Yeah. I like that he's fading back with these nares. Oh, my God. It's like that's one of those things where – you can just see every step. Yeah. Like when you're playing, you're like, I had no idea. Uh huh. But there, you were like, he From the react. commentary? He knew. Absolutely. Oh, Everything. Man. Oh, nice. Oh. Just like that, two to two. This is this is actually kind of scary. This is actually a lot closer than we're making it sound. <laughs> he almost just fucking died there. Yeah, that was pretty bad. <laughs> Dude, that was that was really intimidating for a half second there. I was like, oh shit. <laughs> I don't need to get judged on this. That was the worst. Have you ever commentated with someone really good before? Uh, it's intimidating, no. man. I really, I, I commentated PM 
with fucking Junebug. I was like, <laughs> oh, you take the lead on this one, man. I'll provide color. I would. It's honestly one of my dreams to commentate with Frog. He's my been my favorite oh, for yeah. a while. All well, right. Plup cleans us up as we talk about yeah. uh, Winton Smith, the man. Plup. Probably done with the Falco for the day. I kind of want to ask him. Potentially, potentially. Should I ask him? Because he looks It's bad. a gym move. It's a gym move for sure. I'm not going to do it. But that's not always a, a bad hey, thing. Hey, my middle name is Jimmy. I